every district attorney's office throughout the country should have a conviction integrity unit. Uh, and it's basically policing ourselves to make sure that we're doing it right. Convicting guilty people and exonerating innocent people is what the justice system's all about. 40 cases were actually tested and 18 came back to be uh, innocent. Um, and so, you know, for us, that is a major issue. I expect for the DNA testing today to come back in my favor. Uh, the results will be negative, that uh, I was not the person that committed the rape. They not only destroyed my life, but they destroyed other people's lives that was totally innocent, has nothing to do with it. When you take a situation and people tell you that you're guilty of it and you know you didn't do it, you should not have to pay for that. I've paid for something I haven't done. There's a lot of evidence. It's more than obvious that I'm not guilty, and they finally figured it out. Someone has lost 25 years of their life. There's a son he's never met until now. They're good, man. You just can't imagine that you could actually be out there doing some good. And especially when you're an old chick like me and I've done this for a while and you've seen so many bad cases, it's such a relief to know that we can come in and work with the DA's office and get people out that need to get out. I understand that they lock my body up, but I refuse to let them lock my mind up. Because I've seen guys in my situation that lose it and just get ate up by the system and they don't know how to function outside the system. I refuse that that happen to me. My family should never have to go through this. Like my mother, I watched her so many times cry, leaving me. And I try to always let her see me being upbeat and happy and smiling. It doesn't work when you see your child confined for something that they say they didn't do. How you doing? I'm doing all right. How you Kirk doing? Kirk Watkins. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. Congratulations. Thank you. You looking forward to tomorrow, I suppose. Yes, sir. Oh, the first thing I'm going to do when I get out is hug my mother, hug my kids, and find out where we're going to eat. Even my mother didn't know for sure, but I knew. And that's basically what kept me with the drive to want to fight and prove to everyone I'm telling the truth. My story and my mother's story together, it'll open a lot of eyes. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. What a warm day.